Okay, I gotcha. Alright, baby, I see what you're trying to pull here. UNN2 was cancelled, but now, all of a sudden, it's been brought back into the spotlight because you've been working on it behind the scenes? Okay, okay, well, I guess the only reasonable thing to do is analyze this trailer and see what we can come up with. Originally, there was going to be a build released to, I'm guessing, the public, though Baby never said, um, this September, but she wanted to hold off on that and give it more extra time to work on, so now it's been delayed to a 2020 release. Baby has released a, a trailer, a teaser trailer, for Nintendo Night Dose, so we're going to check that out. I've already seen it, so I'm not going to be reacting to it. I'm just going to go... Uh, very detailed analysis, frame by frame. It's gonna be a 45 minute video. <laughs> it's really not much, it's only, let me check. It's only like a minute, half of it isn't even new information, it's just footage of the old game, so we don't really have that much to go off of, but I'm gonna try my best to come up with a story based on the trailer itself, the description of the trailer, some posts that Baby has made on the Game Jolt, and information that she has given me Gonna use that to my advantage, haha, uh -huh. baby keep your secrets, <laughs> she's never gonna trust me ever again. Yeah, so I'm not gonna drag out this intro any longer, we're gonna check out the trailer, see what we can come up with. So we're just going to, the beginning bit, it really isn't anything special, it's just footage of the first game, we already, we've already seen this, so not much to talk about here. You remember the first game? Of course we do. Blast. Fun times. Very fun times. But now a new nightmare begins. Whoa, whoa, game footage is not final. We're gonna watch through it once, and then an investigation, and then go back through it. Oh, shoot. Is that... Who is that? I can't imagine. Is that Riberon? I don't know how to pronounce their name. New foes await. I've seen this trailer at least, like, three or five times. <laughs> Multiple custom nights. Wow. Alright, I'm already seeing things that we need to talk about. Jigglypuff, game over, I guess you're gonna make it. Don't get rested. Ultimate Nintendo Night 2, 2020. So like I said, the first beginning bit really isn't anything special. You remember the first game, that's basic information, and then a new nightmare begins. That's just referencing a new game coming out, 2020. And then we get to the really deep stuff, right here. Uh, also... I mentioned it while we were watching it, but game footage not final, of course. So we see Ashley, stuck in a chair, tied up, and she breaks th she breaks free. So we've actually seen this Ashley in the the real demo for the game. Um, God, that was back in January. It's like, I think it might have been like exactly January 2nd. So it's been a while, but yeah, we, we, played, it, we played as Ashley and we got to talk to Crash and some other characters. And we know there's an investigation going on at a fan Nintendo establishment. <laughs> I don't know, it's weird. An investigation, and then we got Ribberon, Dark Ribbon. I'm not entirely sure how to pronounce their name. And then they look down at us with their terrifying eyes. Next up, we've got new foes await. New characters are coming, obviously. This is interesting. This really reminds me of uh, Sister Location's mini games where you have to not the mini games but you know like during the nights where you have to sneak around funtime auditorium and below a gallery just like in help wanted which was terrifying so you can see that we're moving we're moving through a room and we're trying to get to a door there's a red carpet checkerboard pattern there's the door and this ooh, what does that say in the on the drum there the P Jiggles, awesome. <laughs> the PJ Eagles. Okay, so yeah, we're walking through a room. This is interesting. So we've already we've already seen this, obviously, but this is some sort of performance stage. I'm not sure if this is the main stage, but yeah, I'm not entirely sure. You can see a guitar, some drums. I think that might have been like a saxophone. There's a mic there. 12 a.m., so we're obviously going to be here from 12 to 6, and then as we're shining our flashlight around, the battery is slowly draining, so we got to keep an eye on that. Yeah. Oh, no. What? God, what is... That's not a saxophone. It's a tuba. 
All right. Yeah, so we're looking around. Multiple custom nights. So there's going to be multiple levels we have to play through. And then here we see a classic Five Nights at Freddy's fan game. You know, we got the cameras. You've got more batteries. You've got a two next to it. I'm not entirely sure what that could mean. Maybe we have, like, two sets of batteries, and then when one goes out, we get to replace it. Not entirely sure. Well, let's see, how many cams are there? It looks like there's 11 cameras. Again, 12 to 6. And then we're back here. And then, again, this. Yeah, that one makes me makes me believe that we have two sets of batteries. Here we can see Mr. Game & Watch. Um, I think, is that gooey? I'm not entirely sure. There's a vent here, there's two doors here. We got the whack. <laughs> because why not? Uh, I'm very disappointed to see that there was no fan. Um, <laughs> just saying, baby, I have a feeling you are going to watch this, so... Yeah, very disappointed that there was no fan. Shame. <laughs> All jokes aside, though, this office... You can see we got the, the classic doors and lights. I'm guessing that's going to be on both sides. There's no light button for the vent, which is interesting. Yeah, doors, lights on the other side as well. And then we get a jump scare from Jigglypuff, which looks like it could be in... Yeah, you can just barely see it. The So we've run out of battery for our flashlight in the band section. And then I'm going to try and pause it. I can't. But yeah, this is the jump scare for Jigglypuff. Very interesting. And then we get the game over screen, and it says, Guess you couldn't make it. My mic's covering it. And then we got Ribber on in the back. And then, don't get rested. Not entirely sure what that could mean. Um, maybe we, like, fall asleep. <laughs> or maybe it's, like, don't get rested from the invest... I don't know. <laughs> awesome predictions from me. And then Ultimate Nintendo Night 2 2020. The description for the game reads, In Nintendo N Ultimate Nintendo Night 2, you can play more than one custom night. You'll be caught in many scenarios such as a music room, a kitchen, and God forbid, a generic FNAF 1 clone. You play as Ashley, an investigator of the Nintendo fan location, we still haven't thought of a name yet, who has a job of exposing the truth of Riveron, the location, and what lies beneath. What trouble awaits, find out in 2020. Yeah, so like I said at the beginning, we are in a fan location of Nintendo. Not entirely sure what that's going to lead to, because we're not in the actual Nintendo establishment, like Nintendo of America. We are going to be in different scenarios, like it said, a music room, a kitchen, and a just regular FNAF 1 clone. So the music room is the band stage. We've seen that in the trailer. The kitchen, I don't I think we saw that, and then the FNAF 1 clone we saw quite a bit of, and I'm not entirely sure if that's all of the scenarios that we're going to be put into. I'm guessing there is probably going to be more than just three, because three's not a whole lot, if I'm being honest. Everything I'm about to say may or may not be true, because this was said back in January, um, back when the demo first came out, so obviously things could change from now, uh, from then to now, and from then to the release, and from now to the release. So not everything I'm gonna say is final, but something I can say for sure is that this game is going to be pretty, pretty, pretty story-driven. We saw it in the demo, the real demo, not the one with Big Chungus, which I'm still upset to <laughs> say that that was the first video of 2019 that's on the channel. That's pretty sad. First video was about Big Chungus. But yeah, in the real demo, it was pretty story driven. We were playing as Ashley. I think we found like a dead body, which was kind of creepy. We also got to talk to Crash and I want to say Spyro, but I honestly cannot remember. We got to talk to a few characters, definitely Crash. I remember him being there and they were telling us about something. <laughs> I don't know. It's been a while since I played it again. It was back in January, but the video was still up. So if you want to go check that out, I'll link it in the description. Of course, the trailer is going to be linked down below anyways. And also the game page is going to be linked down below. I'm pretty sure that... Actually, I'm, yeah. I'm pretty sure that Nintendo Night 2 is going to have its own game show page as well. Um, I'm pretty sure Baby said that. Baby has come up with her own story that she's going to be trying to tell throughout this game. That's it. That's the whole trailer. That's the analysis. This really was an interesting trailer because the second game is going to differ so much from the first game. And not only do we have quite a while to wait... Uh, again, 2020. But the good part is, Baby has said that I am getting an early copy. So thanks, Baby, for that. That's really, that's really nice. If you want to check out the original trailer for yourself, it's linked down below. The first game's linked down below, and 
um, both the videos I did on the demos are linked down below. So thank you everyone so much for watching. Make sure you go give Baby some love because this this game is coming along great. I'm super excited for it. Hopefully you guys are too. And I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.